Well, I've spent 40 years trying to figure out how teeth work. In fact, I sometimes say that I spent 40 years trying to understand how rhinoceros is chew. And I think I finally almost do. The reason I've been doing this is that teeth are, um, you can think of them as an interface between an animal, a mammal, and its um, edible environment. So therefore, if you understand the teeth, you understand the most important aspects of the environment. And since our business is to, to understand what the world was like in the past, we're trying to understand how it works today. If we go far enough back in geological time, so two billion years ago, we may have had a mountain range that was something like the size of the Himalayas and Tibetan Plateau, a massive mountain system. Uh, and what we have here that's rather unique are the rocks that are actually deeply buried beneath the surface of some place like the Himalaya today that are actually exposed to the surface and kind of give us a little bit of a window into exploring deep inside a large mountain system, even though now we have nothing but a relatively flat landscape. We have a very enthusiastic group of teachers, uh, very motivated students. So I really think this is a very good environment to learn. Um, and also because we do offer a very broad selection of courses and topics to study. Viime syksyn mä olin Yhdysvalloissa Länsirannikolla kaksi viikkoa kenttäkurssilla. Ja siellä, kun se geologia on kaikesta näkyvimmillä ja ne paikat, missä puhutaan niissä lukuissa artikkeleissa, mitä sä oot kolme vuotta lukenut, niin on sun silmiä edessä. Ja sit sä näet sen kaiken, vielä, sen kaiken asian vielä geologin silmin, niin se on jotenkin, ei sitä tunne, ei sitä tunne tulla kuvailla. Well, one advantage that people don't often think about is that there is an advantage in being small. You're not as tied to mainstream thinking. You, you're more free, intellectually more free. You meet more people. Certainly it's a, it's a great benefit to, to have in the same campus area the, the various scientific departments and branches. And there is a lot of synergy. That's actually the place where you can learn how to cooperate with different type of people. So the general idea and the general philosophy with the master's program is to provide our students with a broad education in modern geoscience, but also allow them opportunities to gain expertise within certain topics. I truly believe that we are educating um, people uh, that are very needed um, in many sectors in the society, uh, in the industry, as well as researchers um, who will be able to continue the research in this field. There's a social interaction that happens within our field and within our program that I think is a bit different than some other scientific disciplines. They interact with, the, with one another and get to know each other at a little bit deeper level than I think most students do in other disciplines. Se on ehkä se semmoinen tietynlainen yhteenkuuluvuus, mikä siellä, mikä siellä Helsingin yliopistossa geologian osat vallitsee. Se on, se on semmoinen juttu, mitä, mitä ei välttämättä löydä, löydä muualta.